So hi everyone, my name is Lorenzo Murzilli. I'm the founder of Murzilli Consulting and the co-founder of Drone Talks. And uh, today I'm speaking with uh, Natale Di Rubbo from EASA, you know, Drones Project Manager, about a very interesting workshop, which uh, Natale will explain soon. It's gonna happen tomorrow here at uh, Amsterdam and room 1A at nine o'clock. And it is about the UAS operations outside of a U-Space airspace, Natale. So how do you use SORA and how do you use U-Space services? Uh, to make this happen. So welcome Natale and let's go talk a little bit about this workshop. Thank you. Good morning to everybody. Thank you for the invitation. Yeah, I will be very happy to provide uh, the, the, what will be to, uh, the topic of tomorrow. Amazing. I mean, like at the end of the day, it's all about enabling, enabling BVLOS operations, right? This is what we want to do. We all know that this is the factor that will definitely foster the market, right? So, but what is the main challenge? Yeah, so we know that uh, we need to find a way to integrate drone with uh, other traffic. Now, uh, we have a solution, like so the use space will be the solution. But uh, the question is, can we deploy use space everywhere uh, in all the European airspace? Yeah. Because then use space will require some, some challenges, some, uh, some activity to be conducted. And maybe I'm not sure if it's cost effective yeah. to have use space everywhere. But on the other side, uh, are we sure that we cannot use some use space service also in area where use space is not provided? So the, the, until we don't have a very reliable detect and avoid system, we will not be able to really separate drone from other traffic. So we are, at this moment, we don't have a solution yet. Well, we are not here to, to, def to define what uh, should be uh, the, the best way. Tomorrow, mostly, uh, we will be here to listen, to discuss with uh, uh, the panelists, but uh, really would like to have uh, uh, the people with, uh, with some kind of interaction to have inputs that then we can use in the future on uh, how we can uh, develop some regulatory material that will help this integration. Amazing. So what, are, what is the main objective of the workshop? It's like, what are you trying to achieve with the workshop? Yeah, so first of all, identify what are the challenges and uh, uh, to see also what are the experience that in some member states uh, are already uh, uh, already in, um, in, uh, in place. We know that, especially in Germany, uh, there are uh, some, uh, tech, some technology to use to identify what kind of traffic uh, is, uh, is going on. And so I think that uh, uh, there is a way already to identify what is the, the number of, uh, um, of manned and unmanned aircraft that are flying in the different areas. So maybe uh, we can identify something that will uh, give all the, the information to the drone operator to be safely separate from other traffic. So tomorrow will be more to, to, to understand what is the situation and what could be possible uh, suggestions. Amazing. And, you know, we have a large uh, crowd here in Amsterdam Drone Week. And uh, whom are you really wanting to see at the workshop? Who are the stakeholders that you want to engage the most? And, you know, how will you use their inputs? What, what is going to be the follow up after the workshop? Yeah, for sure. So the, the stakeholders are the drone operators. So those that need to do this operation. And we see that uh, uh, we have a, a very uh, active community here in Europe. Uh, I'm amazed because uh, I received every day, almost every day, some very, very smart solution from operators. So really, I think that those that uh, are the one that needs to do the operation are also the one that have more inventive, more fantasy to uh, provide some very effective solutions. So I think that uh, the input should come from the operator and then uh, for sure they should be reviewed by the, uh, the aviation authority, by the, the service providers. And then all together we need to find a safe solution. Amazing. So I'll, I'll be there for sure. This is one of the most interesting workshops, I think, of, uh, of tomorrow. Thank you very much, Otale, for, uh, for the chat and see you around. Thank you. See you tomorrow.